Hiya, James here from the James Oliver Guitar Channel and today we're going to talk about this. This is my old original 1963 Fender Telecaster in like a dirty blonde colour. It's one of the best guitars I own. It's a great sounding, great playing instrument and I thought today we'd talk about it and talk about his, his quirks and his idiosyncrasies etc. And what sort of players play them and do a couple of little sound demos of it. Just for a bit of fun. So first of all I'll show you the guitar. Here's the headstock. It's the back of the headstock. You can see there's the back of the neck. There's some real cool wear patterns on the back of the neck. Of course the clay dotted neck. There's the body, the front. Here's the back. One of the idiosyncrasies is the strange sort of, I don't know if you can see there, there's a little bit of strange string spacing going on which never really seemed to bother me when uh, playing it. It does have the original nut as well believe it or not as you can see that is the original nut so I've been told. So that's the original nut. He's even, he even got the dead sounding neck picker which I'll play you in a minute. The gear I'm playing through, Silverface Champ, Volume on 6, Treble on 6, the uh, bass on 5. And last week when I done the Pink Paisley demo, somebody wanted a Uli with distortion, so the only pedal I'm running is this Tube Screamer. This is an old one, it's from... It's from... 82. It's a, it is an original one. Anyway. So we got the Tube Screamer for the dude. And the settings on the Tube Screamer uh, is there, as you can see. The, the, the level's on 5.2, the overdrive is on 5.2, and the tone is just after 12. So there's all the settings. And before we play the guitar, I thought we'd talk about, you know, a couple of people that use the old 60s tellies. Wilco Johnson's black and red telly was a 62. I'm not sure what year they was, but Joe Strummer from The Clash played a 60s telly. Of course, Mike Bloomfield, when Dylan went electric at uh, the Newport Folk Festival, was playing a guitar very similar to this. Steve Cropper uses a 60s telly custom, I believe. Muddy Waters has got a rosewood neck red telly. So yeah, there's lots of people that use these 60s tellies, and if you, if you can think of anyone else, stick it in the comments below. So anyway, I'm just first of all, I'll, ju I'll just play you a uh, G chord on each of the pickups, just so you can hear the guitar, you know, naturally ring out. You know, just a simple G chord with a clean sound, and hopefully you'll get the overtones of the instrument. I don't know how it's going to come across with this iPad, but nevertheless, here we go. So this is the bridge pickup. <laughs> sound which is a strange old sound and I believe it's just a capacitor that um, you know and you can change the sound but I want to keep this original because it's a you know it is a nice piece and I like it a lot as, as it is and as I've said before I'm mainly a bridge pickup man so I may as well leave it as it is so I think before we crack on with a bit of playing I think I'll play some famous -y sort of riffs, you know, like, um, it's just a um, bit of rock set by Dr. Feel because it's the same sort of guitar. You know, Wilco played this, well, not this guitar, but it's very similar, and I think the sound is pretty close. Also, when Mick Green was playing with Johnny Kidd, you know, when they were doing stuff like... When they were doing like and Tally at a 63 Tally. And of course it does that great stinging muddy water slide sound, which I love as well. The, you know, the... Up a little bit for slide, but there we are. Does that sort of thing? And it was a great picking guitar, you know, for all that. And 
and you can do your. guitar stuff which you, you know I love my favorite lick of all time so yeah I mean that's the uh, bridge pickup you can do a nice go sound but I'll try and demonstrate it for you. I mean I don't even really know I mean with the overdrive uh, it's, it's not it's not even a is it a woman tone? I, I don't know. Anyway, I don't know. So that's the uh, free, the, uh, free, the free pickup song, Clean. You got this one, you know. Which is a dead sound. You got that. Bridge. Sorry. Neck. Bridge. Now the overdrive. Obviously the the uh, bridge pickup. And then you've got the uh, neck. So that's, it's, it's a very nice, like, rocky neck pickup sound. Very real. I put the old distortion on, you know, so. And then you've got that uh, funny sound. voices of the guitar of course you know you've got that bridge neck and you've got that funny old i i mean i i don't know if this is true right but i did you that it's sort of a you could do a pseudo bass sort of sound but it's just peculiar so yeah this is my uh, 63 telly i hope you enjoyed the demo and i hope you like the sounds that they made, I know the play is a little bit sloppy, but we're only having a bit of fun here on uh, YouTube, aren't we? And uh, keep supporting the channel and liking, sharing and subscribing. And if you like these sort of videos, i got a couple of guitars. Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll do a couple of these sort of talking demos, you know, when you can hear the guitar through the champ. i got a nice magnetone here and an AC-30 and stuff. 
but we can't play them in the house because next door they complain. But never mind. I like the champ. I hope you enjoyed the video. There's lots of videos on the channel of me playing this guitar. There's some live footage of me playing the guitar if you want to watch that as well. And if you're not sure some of the names I mentioned in the video, I'm sure you are. But if you're not, check them out on YouTube because it's always worth having a look at it. And I really appreciate it and uh, I look forward to seeing you at the next video. Thank you very much. Cheers.